Interesting. I, I, I see that the Bartle Mac Pro Celluloid Valve and Relay Tester is chemical resistant and salt and moisture proof. Now, it can be used underwater, uh, around salt water with no negative effects, which makes it invaluable in cargo shipping industry and also other industries, offshore uh, oil rigs and places like that. In many applications in industry today, resistance to chemicals is very important and test equipment must be of a much higher standard. Now, I understand you really take pride at, at, at Bartle Research in manufacturing uh, the MagProbe and its resistance to most chemicals, and it, and it is salt and moisture proof. Now, this is accomplished by manufacturing the, the tester as a completely self-contained uh, and sealed unit. Is that correct? Yeah, it is. And the reason for that is so we could use it in uh, explosive environments. So it's uh, intrinsically safe. That is, it's so well sealed and the voltage is so low and the current is so low, it's down into milliamps is all you use to make the LED operate. So you don't have any problem with that. But uh, as far as the chemicals go, any chemical can eat up any material. But basically, we were after salt water, salt spray, and some of the basic chemicals they use in uh, manufacturing, but we haven't had any problem with that at all. In fact, sometimes they got so saturated with chemicals around them in, in oil companies and uh, refineries and oil drilling operations that uh, they were quite <laughs> quite ugly, quite black, in the, but they still operated. That was the main thing. It was, it was absolutely safe, and uh, that's why it's sealed. Okay, well, I understand that in clean rooms, uh, uh, one of the main chemicals used to uh, sterilize products going in and out of clean rooms is isopropyl alcohol. So it doesn't really have any issues with isopropyl alcohol. Is that correct? No, it didn't. In fact, we uh, submerged it in isopropyl alcohol for at least a half a day or a full day, actually. We did that. Four units directly in isopropyl alcohol. Absolutely no problem. But the beautiful fall, it will kill most of the germs. But for those applications, like uh, for in space labs where they work on equipment, and they have these massive clean rooms where they work the have the rocket engines and all that. They work wearing bunny suits, you know, and have to go through clean rooms. I mean, this doesn't have any problem with that. You can go right into those units, and uh, uh, if you know somebody needs sterilization, which is uh, they use a cold cold sterilization process, which they use in hospitals. You can use the same process, and you could just dip it in that solution and take it right into the into the environmental environmentally uh, uh, clean uh, and uh, sanitized space. Okay, thanks. <laughs>